Have you ridden Storm's brother before? So you have ridden him lots of times? How does he feel compared to Echo? Longer neck. Good boy, Stormy. You'd be good to Joy. He's being really slow and, and careful. That's what he does. If he doesn't know, he doesn't know if you know how to ride yet. So he's being extra careful with you. See how he's like trying to make sure she doesn't fall? Yeah. <laughs> That's what he does. And so we're waiting for Fiona. She's having trouble. Her baby's having some issues. We're waiting for Fiona. And girls are already up on their horses and Sophie's practicing at a walk, getting the walk that she wants and keeping Finn calm, but the boy is doing so much better. Never seen him walk this slow before, like, and this has been consistent. Take him for a stroll, take, go through the whole thing. Are you excited? She's excited. You guys might remember Joy. You guys might remember Joy from camp. We've seen her at camp before. It's windy today, but it's not too hot, so that's good. Oh, so Fiona just told them to remove their feet from the stirrups. Yeah, pick the windiest day, you guys. There might be. <laughs> She's like, I did not plan to ride ride stirrupless. Oh, he likes that. He's kind of stretching out a bit more. Finny. So you're just gonna duck when you go in the door. And then he won't be so spooky. He's never usually ever spooky. Gabby's gonna open the door. The worst, like, the thing. Duck your head. It's the first time Sophie's ever gone through a door. All right. All right. She no knows. He's like, I'll be, I'll be waiting here for you, Gabby. <laughs> he wants his friends. All right, so we came inside because the wind was wild out there. And this is her first time riding Storm and he's looking like he doesn't know what's happening and he was spooking a little from the wind out there and we didn't want it to be a bad ride. So uh, Fiona's here, we're just waiting for her to come and then I'll help her set up. So you guys know that we've been saying that we want Sophie to ride with people her own age and at her own level instead of having to be with the older girls. So this is the start of that. So Sophie is so excited about the fact that she has got Finn going slow for the first time ever. Like this is a long time coming. Oh, she got him going. That's fabulous. And Sophie was taking her time to make sure that she was going to get the right trot. Right. I've spent my days being ready to go I have lived my life on the road I always keep on moving on So if you push your hands forward and use your seat to slow him down There, much better Do you see his you little mouth? Dog? Did you see his mouth? Yeah. Was he relaxed? Yeah. Did you see that? His jaw was just hanging loose like when I groomed the mares and they let their lip you just... You see it moving right now, he's gonna relax. Yeah, this is the first time Finn has ever done this. So Joy, when you wanna get him in the corners more, you can push him over with your inside heel. He does very okay, well to listen to your leg. Look at this, oh wait a minute. So right here, start pushing him with your left leg. Yep, see how much closer to us you get? There you go. Instead of pulling with your right rein, leave your right rein forward and use your left foot. Is there a pitchfork in here? As he drags her foot down the... We're having pork for dinner. We're not having dinner. He's got time for dinner. No, he's being fabulous. All right, Hello. thumbs on top, ladies. Are you having a lesson today? No. Hey, girly.
got up on an early Sunday morning to say Loosen your rein, Sophie. We have no flat class this weekend. I know. Just over fences. The stormy boy trekking along. Give away that right rein, Joy. Use your left heel to keep him over. He will stay on the rail if you use your leg. Yeah, look at her. He's he's dragging her leg down the... Mm -hmm. So put your right hand forward. There you go. Keep it forward. You keep wanting to pull him over, so keep it forward so you don't pull him. Yes, he doesn't need to be pulled. He's got it. All right, ladies, let's change your rein across the diagonal. Uh, you need to go get my horse. So I have to get my COVID shot. It's pretty fast. Uh, yeah, you might want to get riding. Brandon's getting his COVID shot today, too. Exciting, exciting. I was going to say, you picked a perfect time to go, Paige. Uh -huh. <laughs> How come everybody can ride Storm but me? Like, when I sit on him, he doesn't even go. He goes backwards. Oh. All right, ladies, just take a breather. Fiona says... Ponies need a minute. Fiona says, I've never seen Finn move his mouth like that before. I've seen, so is he licking and chewing kind of? Like a variation of that? Why are you being grumpy? Uh, no, my mare does it too, she rides. She just lets yeah. her jaw hang. Yeah, my mares too. Yeah, like both of my, yeah. oh. They just, they're more comfortable. <laughs> so Finn's doing that now. Like that's a huge win. So I think that one of the big things that Sophie learned recently was to not do anything until she has everything right. So it took her a long time to start rising trot. That was a breakthrough lesson we had the other day, wasn't it? It was huge. Mm -hmm. And she's learning that she needs to take time to herself before a lesson to get her stuff together and yeah. figure it all out. And I've told them over and over again, but it finally sunk in, which is nice. They don't have to rush to go ahead and do something when they're asked to do it. I know, but there's so much pressure, especially when there's like a lot of people in the ring. I get that. And she feels pressure right. like me. The biggest thing, especially in a show ring, if you have to take an extra 10 steps to get something nice, the judge will like the perfection over the scramble. Yeah. I can't believe that Finn slid in his... This looks really nice, Joy. Stretch those heels all the way to the ground for me. Change your rise back. When you land, Joy, think about landing on the front of that saddle. Change your rise back. He bumped you. Yep. Is this a good trot? I do like it. I do like I it. I want to see you relax your body a little bit more. Think about your rhythm, less rain, slower seat. But boy, stormy night. Stretch those heels. Every time you go up, the heel goes down. That's it. So think about your bum. If it's working, if you feel like you're really having to work, it's too fast. You want to feel like you're kind of floating. Yeah, that's better right away. Debbie's having some food, getting ready for her lesson. Inside leg, push him over. Every time you want to get him close to the rail, use your leg, not your hand. She can ride Storm better than me. Let all the energy just oh, off your shoulder. Look at Finn's mouth. See him? Bring your lower leg back a little bit. Oh, I think the nose net made a big difference. Like, I know she's riding different too, but I think that nose net has changed him. I do too. I think he feels confident. With I him. think that, yeah, for whatever reason, it's there, making him feel confident. Up. Push those hands together, thumbs on top. Ooh, Ooh. chipmunk. Yeah. Chipmunk. <laughs> Look at the mouth. <laughs> Storm loves this. You know what he loves? He just loves walking around and being relaxed and not having to, like, really do anything crazy. This is the kind of lesson he likes. Strips in, two point trot. Let's turn it out, ladies. So I was like, my legs are already dead, Fiona. Yeah. That's, oh, cause she hasn't ridden in a while, right? Last week. Oh, she did ride last week? With uh, Brandon, yeah. She rode um, Echo. Switch your whip over. <laughs> I was gonna ask how lessons were going. Handsome man. Oh, look at that, he's framing for you. Look. Look how gorgeous he looks. All right, two point drop when you're ready there, Joy. Yeah, he's 
Lessons are going really well. Okay. He gets right and gets her. Stick your bum backwards. There. All right, there's the wrist. Fiona's making her trot forever until she keeps the wrist straight. Slow your ride. Tighten your inner thigh, remember, and physically slow your bum down. Like you're floating up and floating down. See the difference in your horse? Um, a caterpillar just fell on me. From the rot, from the roof. Probably from that bird's mouth. From the bird's mouth. From a bird's mouth. Uh -huh. That's great. Put your hands up in front of your martingale. It's scary. Thank you. My horse is at the round bale right there by the fence. By the time you're ready to go get your horse and get him ready, he'll be gone. I'm just call him and he'll come slowly. Yeah. All right, this is happening. Bad, bad news. Gather your reins. Gather your reins. <laughs> it's not fair to laugh. Don't drop the ball. Don't drop the ball. Yeah, I can wash my hands now. That's fun. That would have been helpful before. She's like, thank you. When I was dying, you can put them on the sides of the ball. You don't have to put them on the top. Bit. But you little now little can't physically bring your hands into your lap because there's a ball in the way. You can slide them down the sides of the ball so they're lower, closer to his neck. <laughs> What'd you say? You think she'll drop the ball, Joy? <laughs> Joy's like, I should drop the ball. So what happens if she drops the ball, Fiona? <laughs> That's even harder. I know. That's what you have to do, Sophie. You have to get in the habit of it. Okay, just because it's fun, let's go rising trot. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Light feet canter. Because you can't see, Sophia, change your rising. Oh, no. There you go. Thumbs on top there, Joy! I got tricks on my sleeve for that too, so careful! Uh-oh, I feel like she's... She's got another ball for you! <laughs> Actually, you have a whip. That's perfect. Put your whip underneath both your thumbs at the same time. So she's moving the ball up and down. Is that what she's supposed That's to be doing? It, all it is doing is preventing her from bringing her hands into her crotch. That's all I want her to stop doing. She needs to learn to keep her hands out in front. Finn is confused. You need to loosen your reins though because you're bumping his mouth. He stop coming so close. So put your whip across your hand so that it's over underneath you. Yeah, you got it. Got See, it. that's what happens when you laugh, sister. Loosen your reins a little bit. Storm likes a nice loose rein. You don't have to hold them tight. Relax the body. Slow with the booty. There. Can't bend your wrists in, can't bring your hands to your crotch. It's gonna make you ride with a ball all the time. No. <laughs> You'll be jumping with the ball. It'll prevent it from over two pointing. Yep. Yeah, it is good to work out. Me? Yep. Still doing the same thing. Okay, okay. okay. You're gonna walk for a minute, join, then we're gonna canter. That's okay. Okay, walk for a second. Give him a breather. He just tripped and caught himself. You did very good to balance yourself so he could get back up. Yep, Give so him a good. Pat, tell him he's okay. So there was a trip. Her and she popped her knee, she said. Real horse girls. Uh oh. Good boy. Come to him. He likes to hear your voice. You know that. Use the arena, stretch your body, and push your hands out, or I will give you back that ball. I'm dying. I need You'll be okay. You got two more laps, and you can walk. Two more. Dig down deep, find some strength. Much better. I say, lift 
Lift your inside right a little bit and ask him to step up and stop dropping his shoulder. There. Just touch and then put it back down. We're not holding it up there. You're okay, right on. There you go. Isn't that a fun canter? That's my favorite canter of life. Loosen your reins up, honey, so he can put his head down. This horse with any horse will never, ever go faster. <laughs> Loosen him off. He keeps popping his head up because they're too tight. If anything, there you go. go. Slower. Bring your shoulders back and sit deep in your tail. Good. Think long legs, stretching your heel to the ground. Lean back. Yeah, so look at me. We're like this right now. Bring our shoulder back, open up our chest, drop our bum. That's yeah. better. Beautiful. I want you to keep that feeling and I want you to stand straight up. So, you know why yep. he's such a good horse? Stretch through your Because heels. this, what he's doing right now, anybody could sit that. So, while open he's up doing the that. Again. Yes, you've got it. Thumbs on top will help. You can be relaxed. Down, you close your shoulders. If your thumbs are up, they'll open. Because Stretch you can relax and heels, work on yourself. Lap. And all he does Digging is this. Deep for some muscles. Booty up, girl. Like so. There you go. Get it up. So proud of this horse. All right. Sit and breathe out. Good, Good boy. Job. Canter on from a walk. Good boy. Talk to him. I wasn't standing here the whole time. Oh, it's a lovely breeze. <laughs> there is always a really oh. lovely breeze there. Take it back and down and reset yourself so we're not so fast. Lift your inside rein in the corner. Lift him up so his shoulder is not dropping. There, and drop it. Good. Half halt, breathe. Use your thighs when you half halt. Thank you. That booty. <laughs> Stay tall and stretch your heel down. Good. Now, every time your bum wants to come down, Joy, use your legs to keep it up in the air. Sassy with me. I kiss and he's like, mm. I know. That's the mm. thing about Storm. If you kiss too many times, he gets mad. He does not like any pressure. Stretch taller. Goal is to keep your tail out of the pack. There, down through your heels. Push those heels down. Stretch that body up. You can do it. One more lap, but your booty's got to be up. If you sit, you're going to go three laps. Keep your booty up for one. Keep going. Yeah. Get it up. It's just like, I'm so tired. So we're outside now because all the jumping stuff is out here. So that's what we're doing now. Yeah, but he's giving her a hard time. Your back, your oh, there we go. Here. She's giving herself advice. She's learning to, to cross Three. other people. She's got this. <laughs> He's used to Gabby. So she asks him to do stuff and he does it the way he does it for Gabby. He's being really patient with her because she doesn't, she doesn't know him. She hasn't learned him yet.
and he's doing really well. That was better. Look up! One good girl! Diagonal! You gonna throw this one in one more time? Yep. Don't you know that you're beautiful?